Hello everyone, Jared Victor Kilo 3 Bravo Lima here and um, today we're doing an unboxing video. Um, I'm hopefully getting in better at these ones. Please excuse the helicopter. I'm outside at the moment. Um, I promise it has nothing to do with me buying myself an early Christmas present. Um, but I will tell you a funny anecdote. This white sheet I've got here looks pretty white, doesn't it? Um, but when I asked the XYL if we had a white sheet I could use for my video, I was told we had none. And I said, well, what about the bed sheets? And a bit of humming and hawing went on, and then it was concluded that what I really needed was a cream-coloured sheet. So we have one cream-coloured sheet, or perhaps white for you. Anyway, let's have a look at some things I've got here for the car. I've got the Yaesu System Fusion FTM 400 XDR. It's the new model. They've actually got a new PA board in them, so that's pretty interesting. And uh, I've also got something else special on the corner there, which we'll uh, have a look at in a minute. But let's get started. I'm just going to walk around and um, we'll tackle the FTM 400. Please excuse me. Move this off to the side for a second. And what have we got in here? What's in this one first? Hmm. There we have the screen head. Comes nicely wrapped in a um, plastic bag. And it's got a front panel screen protector on it still. So that's nice, taking care of it. Um, it does have a GPS antenna there, by the way. So that's designed to be mounted up. Oh, I should, shouldn't, shouldn't do that. That's designed to be mounted up nice and high in your vehicle. So the GPS antenna Sorry, the GPS antenna can get access to the uh, to the sky and pull in those satellites. So there's that. We've got our warranty card. They look nice. An actual manual. Look at the thickness of that. There's probably more words in that than uh, War and Peace, but um, that's a good thing. Put those over there. Let's have a look in here. We have one, looks like a head unit extension cable. One standard Yaesu microphone. I won't bother taking that out because everyone's seen those before. One little brackety thing, not sure what that's for. Better read this. One little mount comes with, it looks like a sticky pad there. And um, it looks like it's been designed to bend into shape. So that's, and there's some screw holes as well. So that's how you mount your head unit. I think that goes on like so. Some spare fuses. They're just normal fuses, not fast blow types, but still a nice touch. We've got a little adapter here. It goes from stereo to, well, I guess it's maybe mono. Microphone clip, more screws, also some double-sided tape to be temporarily used for something for holding the mobile mounting bracket in place. That's nice. Uh, there are the screws to attach the base to the stand, which is just there. What have we got over here? That's our programming cable. And under here, we have the radio base. So really, I must say, the biggest engineering marvel of all is how much Yaesu managed to pack into that box. That's quite something. Now, I better show you something special. This is the other accessory I got for the truck. This is the one I don't want to tell the wife about. That is a limited edition, 24 karat gold plated diamond antenna. It's the um, Super Gainer 7000G. Now, I'm not actually gonna stick this on the car. This is just something I thought I'd show everyone. There's only two of these in VK or Australia, and um, they're very, they're not for sale. So this was kindly loaned to me by Ross at Strictly Ham, just for showing the world. Um, he told me a funny story about this antenna. Uh, they're still on the Diamond uh, Antennas, or Diamond Antenna Company's um, Bill of Materials or, or Manufacturing Product List but none of the current staff have ever seen one. So 
Ross actually sent a photo over and showed them, but I thought I'd shot off to the world. It's not going on the vehicle. Um, if you do see a golden antenna going around on a video, it's just been done in post. Anyway, hopefully this video recorded properly. This is VK3BL, and I'll catch you all later.